boxes from home is, um, is just an absolute reminder that we are getting support from the American people. The first time we got them, we were shocked first that there was that many packages. And I told them, you know, I don't know what's in them. These are all for my mom. You know, let's open them up and see what it's all about. And then we see the Twinkies and the bubble gum. It's amazing to think that so much joy can come from one little box. Operation Love Boxes isn't a company or an individual. It's an idea. Packaging up pieces of home to send to our soldiers overseas is a powerful and effective way to show them that we care, that they are not forgotten. When you take somebody away from their home, away from their normal environment, uh, the morale can quickly go down. Love Boxes was just a perfect tool for a leader to help raise those spirits up. This is a credible way that the public can get involved and show their support for soldiers more than a sticker on the car or some pledge or some statement. It's a way that you can make a difference. Sending a love box is so easy. Just pick up a free domestic flat rate box from your local post office. If you don't already have an address, simply log on to loveboxesforourtroops.com to obtain the name and address of a soldier overseas. Now, fill the box. Cookies, CDs, gum. Be creative. Some of the favorite things, they love Twinkies, popcorn, jerky, granola bars, things that can go into their pockets, say when they're on patrol. Toothpaste, chapstick, sunscreen. We would receive boxes from schools filled with magazines. They love the Girl Scout cookies. It's not just a great snack, but it's the Girl Scouts, it's Americana, you know, and that was a real big hit. After you filled the box, simply drop it off at your local post office, and for a flat rate, your gift will brighten the life of a soldier overseas. When you have people that don't necessarily have a direct tie to the military, sometimes they don't feel like they have a mission, they don't have a role, and I think that love box fills that gap. So if there's someone out there that has that ability to, to rally the troops, to really motivate, uh, put it in perspective. What is an hour of your time compared to a year of another person's time? When you do get something from home, it's, it is a good reminder and I think it's a good mental break to be able to go back and kind of think about, you know, why you are doing what you're doing. It's not just a box of candy coming from these love boxes. It's, it's a part of home no matter where they are. I saw these boxes coming in, I saw what they meant to the soldiers. To be able to share that with these other troopers and let them um, participate in that and, and let them know that it's more than just us over there. There's people back here that really do care about what we're doing. This is one of those things where it's not copyrighted. If everybody across the nation started doing it, it would be even better. Our website has taken a lot of these ideas and it's there free for anybody to use as a, a way to support their own effort and they can call it anything they want just as long as they do something. Those serving in our military need to know that they are appreciated. As the citizens they are defending, the least we can do is send them a clear message telling them that they are. <laughs>